Ladies and gents, welcome back to the Beer Review Beer channel. We're back for another review. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Thank you so much for checking in. Uh, what we have tonight is a beer coming out of Memphis, Tennessee. This is Wiseacre Brewing Company's Astronaut Status. Barrel Aged Imperial Stout, 12.5% ABV, and we got nothing else. Um, I got on the internet to kind of look to see what barrel it was, if I could find anything. The website has a bunch of pictures of their labels. No info on the beer, though. I found a beer advocate from 2014 that said it was Woodford Reserve Barrels. Um, so that's a bourbon. Um, I don't know what this one was aged in. There's a couple of people that said this was aged with adjuncts, like it was aged with cinnamon and coconut. And then some other people said vanilla. I have no clue. Nothing on the bottle. Um, the bottle's just got these astronauts, weird like Man or Astro Man kind of nod. If you don't know what that band is, look them up. You guys can see that. I will say this though, coolest cap in the game. Look at that. Maybe Green Man's is a little bit better. You guys see that? It's an acorn. I dig it. Into the glass we go. Never had this beer. My buddy, oh, shout out to my buddy Stu who picked this up for me. Um, he hit me up. He was working in Memphis and said, hey, it's out. I said, is it any good? He said, I liked it last year. So I said, yeah, give me a bottle. Oh, what was it, man? 13 bucks, 12.50 or something like that. Into the untapped glass we go. Uh, thick, dark cola. Um, pretty viscous looking. And it's got even like a Coca-Cola head on it. That extra pour got about a full pinky of off-white mocha head. Super tiny bubbles. You can hear it hissing. And guess what it looks like in the glass, y'all? A big imperial stout. Pitch black. No light coming through any of the edges or anywhere. Let's get a nose on it. Ooh. Bourbon or whiskey. I'm going with bourbon. Um, a little bit of barrel. Some vanilla from the oak. I'm sure it's from the barrels. I can't, I don't think it's, it may be. It's hard to tell. There is some vanilla sweetness coming through though. Some dark roasted malts, some chocolate notes, but a heavy dose of bourbon for sure. A little bit of barrel character coming through. Matt over at Massive Beer Reviews got this, uh, he got a bottle of this too in a trade or a shipment I think somebody sent him. So his review will be up soon I'm sure. I don't know if he'll, uh, I don't know when I'll get this posted, but Looking forward to his thoughts on it as well, since I've never had it. This has been out of the fridge probably 20 minutes or so. So it's sitting pretty good. Feels pretty warm in the glass. All right, let's get a taste. That has to have some adjuncts in it. There's no doubt. It's got to. Okay, so mouthfeel medium plus. It's not um, a little oiliness to it. It's not quite full chewy. It's actually medium plus. We'll just leave it there. Um, that's kind of maybe being generous too. Um, but there's like... I didn't get this on the nose. There's like some coffee vibe going on. I feel like I'm losing my mind, y'all. I swear there's like this, it doesn't taste like the bell pepper thing, but it is like the some cinnamon maybe, some chilies of some kind. There's vanilla up front, some sweet chocolate. Some bitter, dark roast on the back end. Some bitter, um, dark malts. Kind of like baker's chocolate. 
a little bit of dark chocolate too. There's like a hint of that, you know, like chocolate can have that cherry taste to it, like good. There's that hint of cherry, like chocolate covered cherry thing going on in this one. I just want there's an adjunct missing. There's something that I don't know that's in here and I can't peg it. It may just be that, it may be that chocolate covered cherry note that's going on. That little, that dark fruit, raisin date, cherry, like black cherry kind of thing going on in the front of this beer. The, for me, the, the burnt roasted bitter in the back balances the sweetness of this beer out really well. I like this beer. There's a sweetness on my lips, y'all, that tastes fruity almost. I don't know what it is, though. It's good. Uh, my, my critique is I wish it was a little bit fuller mouthfeel, which is a little chewier. Maybe just a... But that's, that's, that's my only thing, actually. There has to be vanilla or cinnamon... Or something in this beer. It's got that whole, maybe some, it's not peppers, but it is, maybe it is like coffee that has that green pepper thing going on. I don't know. But there's something in here I can't place. If you've had this beer or know for sure what the adjuncts are, please comment below. Let me know. Uh, good beer. Thanks again, Stu. Astronaut Status from Wiseacre Brewing Company out of Memphis, Tennessee. Pick it up. Until next time, y'all, like, comment, subscribe. Cheers.